and gentlemen, here is the pipe where the reservoir water is diverted through the mountain. It comes out, and as you can see, flows down through this wonderful little place. And just give you a little reference to show you the rock that I'm standing on, man. This thing is not the safest place to be walking, but I'm going to do it anyway. So I just want to show you, and I'm a little bit out of breath, I apologize, but damn, it's a pretty good hike to get up here. And I'm out of shape. So, yeah. And you can see it's kind of roaring down through here. And, yeah, the, my truck is way down there. And then that's the road that I came in on, which goes out to the highway. Got about five miles south of Moab, maybe a little further, maybe about six or seven miles south of Moab. You get to Ken's Lake, which you can barely see down there. So, that's why the waters of Ken Lake or Ken's Lake are so cold, I guess, is because basically this is spring water. It's coming from Mill Creek. We were in it yesterday and it was freaking cold. Very cold, but it's also nice and clear. So if you're ever out to Moab, go just about six miles south on the main highway and you'll see a little sign for Ken's Lake. And as you're driving back to the road to Ken's Lake, look up on the hillside and you'll see this really, really cool waterfall. And uh, don't miss it because these are the little things that I don't think a lot of people take the time to come and check out. So I'm going to, I've seen about all I can see here, so I'm going to go on down to Ken's Lake and see if I can't catch a fish or two.